So I'm going to card here. Yep. Oh my gosh. This Whoa! <laughs> that was so good. Wow. Yeah, that was so good. That's exactly okay. what I was talking about. Okay, okay. Yeah. That's an aggressive movement. Okay. Hi, my name is Jessica Larson. I'm a fixed wing instructor here at SCU. And today we're going to take Jared, a rotor instructor, up and see if he can fly this aircraft. And don't worry, guys. Me being Jared, I can do this. Go ahead and release the brakes. Releasing the brakes. Feet on the floor. Feet on the floor. Engines in the green. Airspeed is live. And see how we're kind of to the left of the center line? Right. Let's kind of inch right. back over to, Try that, to get back to the right. that right side. Okay. All right, my airspeed's indicating 60. Okay, 65, you can go ahead and start that rotation. All right, there's 65, starting that rotation. And now you're going to pitch for 77 knots. 77, so I need to go nose down if I want to go a little bit faster. There's 75, 77, boom. Okay, now you're going too fast, right? So All right, so back, back aft now. Uh-huh, now put your gear up. And gear are coming up. Man, you can't see anything in these. Oh, cool, I'm only going 85, all right, 87. Or, no, 77, there I go. 87, yep. Hey, and now you can go ahead and put that nose back down for about 96 knots. Nose back down, 96 knots. There it is. Why do I have so much right pedal in right now? So these are all the left turning tendencies. Okay. So that's why we have uh, all right, so much 96 knots, there we go. 95 knots summer, see how we're kind of oh, lumping yeah. towards the ground. Okay. Green still. Got our last one to lap. Peter stop at number 14, final number 2. Oh man, I gotta roll out final. I am not lined up. Nope. Alright, 90, uh, 95 knots here. Cool. There we go. Now I can roll out with this final here. Okay. Okay. Now you want to be trimmed for 85 knots here on the final, alright? Okay, so I want my nose up then, right? Right. Alright, so I'm at 90. Avoiding all these wires here. Yep, you don't want to hit those guys. Okay, hands on the throttle, right? Alright, hands on the throttle okay. now. Go ahead and take your throttle all the way out. Right now? Yep. But we're not over the runway! No, you go ahead. Alright, throttle all the way out. Made, okay? Now you're slowly going to start adding back pressure. Okay. So you can land on the mains first, alright? Oh, oh, oh. Ouch! So let me go! <laughs> Alright, uh, that was uh, pretty nice. Cool. And open oh, 96 knots. Yep. There's so much that has to be monitored in this. And if you want, you can add that trim. Remember, you can just trim oh. 96. So if I, I, I mean, am I allowed to let go of this thing? Let go? No. Oh my gosh, I can let go. Amazing, right? Oh. Okay. And you know what? Let's do this. Let's, we'll go out and maneuver for a little bit. All right? Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna botch yeah. this one. Okay, cool. No, no, we're good. We'll just go. We'll just go maneuver for a second. What if I trip my nose down a little bit? For sure. Sure can. Okay. Let's start with the simple one. All right. Start with the simple one. Okay. This one's gonna be a steep turn. All right, cool, so steep turn. You're gonna do the same turn that we just did to clear okay. the area, but I want you to do it at 50 degrees. At 50 degrees, that's this notch here, cool. All right, cool, we clear. We cleared left, center, right, and let's start the just shy of 60 degrees here. We're gonna go to 50 degrees. Okay, cool. Good. And you want to maintain this nice altitude that you set, right? At 7,000. Right, 7,000. So but I'm losing a bunch of altitude. So add in like one turn of throttle. Here. One turn of throttle. Uh huh. Add in some trim. All right, trimming up. That's, oh, that was down. That's down. <laughs> you can feel us. Right. Okay. Cool. I lost 100 feet. So let's go back and get that. And we're still kind of shy, right? We're at maybe 40 degrees of bank. Really get it in there to the 50. Okay. Well, I mean. We're pretty steep as we are. This is the, this is it right here. This is the 50. Okay, this is okay. 50 degrees. Now watch your horizon here. See how we've got a lot of ground in our vision here? Right. That means we're going to lose altitude. So yeah, bring but we got to bring that nose back up. And we still got to keep turning. Right. Okay, let's go, ahead, let's go ahead and roll level here. All right, level we are. Okay, and once you hit level, I want you to roll all the way to the left side. All right, cool. Level, rolling into the left turn here. And we're seeing a lot of ground here, so let's increase uh, that back pressure. Okay, so we've done our nice little, uh, our nice little steep turn. Now okay. We are going to do our accelerated stall. All right, accelerated stall it is. Okay. Banking and bring the yoke to the chest. Yes, sir. That sounds interesting. Okay, cool. So throttles, uh, RPMs are set at 25. Throttles full. So we're turning. Whoa! What's that? We gotta get a little more altitude. Oh, okay. Because yeah, remember we have full power and so we're climbing, so we're just going to climb for a minute and then we'll do the climb. All right, so us helicopter pads, we don't like this whole altitude thing, okay? That's uh, just, I don't like this. Uh -huh. What are your thoughts so far? Easy you know what? Thought? This, is, this is very complex, is what this is. There's a lot going on all at the same time. 
and you've got to just keep an eye on everything all at once. What else are you looking for? Uh, let's do 10,000 feet. So, you have to climb me up to 10,000? What an exciting day, huh? Uh, honestly, yes. All right, so now we're at 10,000. Okay, so now we're gonna do that accelerated stall. Accelerated stall. Okay, so we're gonna start a turn to the 45. Let's go left. So when I do get that stall warning, what am I gonna do? You're just gonna do the same thing that I just had you do. Just let go of pressure on the yoke. So right, push good. that cool. yoke away. So I'm gonna come hard here. Yep. Oh my gosh, these. Whoa! That, a... that was so good. Wow. Yeah, that was so good. That's exactly okay. what I'm talking about. Okay, okay. Yeah. That's an aggressive movement. Okay, so that's the accelerated stall. Okay. All right. That's how you do it now. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Ready? Yeah. All right. Let's go left. I can do this. Okay. All right. Ready? There was that turn. Okay. Going through 30. We're at 45 now, and we're gonna come. Oh. Okay. Oh. oh. Yay! Oh. You got the star warning horn. Wow. Okay, you got it. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know what? I don't like this altitude thing. Let's not okay. do this anymore. You know what? I have a great idea. All we'll right. go ahead and just get down. And not only that, but we'll just get down fast. All right, let's okay. get down fast. So we're going to do an emergency descent. Okay. This is the maneuver that we'll do if we need to lose altitude fast. Like an engine fire. Okay. Um, or say, for instance, you had a pressurized aircraft, you needed to get everyone down fast. Oh, now you're all about those steep turns, <laughs> mister. Um, well, you oh. see, what had happened was... Yeah. This is it. I want you to go power to the idle position. All right, power idle. Put your gear in the down position. Gear down. Okay, bank to 45 degrees to the right. 45 degrees to the right. Now I want you to push that nose down to 150 knots. To 150 knots. Yep, see how I'm going only go, going 100? Right. 150. <laughs> Good. Cool. So typically emergency descents will take way close to the ground and then recover. Um, but just for this one, we only went down to about 7,000 That's feet. perfectly fine. Okay. <laughs> Very nice. Cedar traffic, T-Bird 14, joining a right downwind on a left downwind on a 45. See her. And radio calls me. You know, if I'm not in a helicopter, it's just, it's all out the door. Oh, I don't think I'm going to make this. I'm coming up short. Definitely not going to make the thousands, but maybe we can fix your slam and go a little bit here. All right, cool. Okay, so just really smoothly, just keep this pitch attitude right here. So nice, okay, right? Okay. Oh, much nicer. You know what? Actually, guys, being a helicopter instructor and flying in a complex uh, fixed wing, it is very, very, very complex, actually. There's 18 things going on all at once, and it's... Um, it's, it's a good training tool. In fact, it's a letting us know that how much there is to do at one time. And Jessica was gracious enough to teach me and also let me mess up a little bit. I think Jared did a really great job. Uh, pretty good aircraft control. Obviously, the flares are something that we'll uh, have to maybe practice in the future. We'll work on the flares. But uh, definitely put in a good effort for sure.